He's just a cool guy, looks great, knows how to deliver the product. This is Mark. He's, my, he's our Hi, big, big star. Mark Vanderloo got a lot of um, exposure early on because top designers like to use him. He kind of personifies all American. He's, he's classic, he's modern. Mark's probably been at the top of this game now for almost five years. He's become as well known as many of his female counterparts. I think I have an easy, marketable face, and I think that's what attracts a lot of designers. Right now, I'm, I'm like really busy uh, with with the modeling and press campaigns, and um, I've been shooting a lot of commercials, which I really like because if you do as soon as you do something moving, it gets more interesting. Whatever comes along, I'm you know I'm open to and would like to do, and uh, if I have a good time, hey, why wouldn't I do it? two of them for the new Donna Karen campaign at that time. He has this great idea together with Donna Karen to put us together to do this Nick and White campaign. It's funny because when I speak to the people at Donna Karen, it's very cute to hear the way the whole four-day shoot developed. And we worked for three days. Day one, it was kind of like, hello, how are you doing? By day three, when it was cold out, Mark was helping to take care of Esther with his jacket and like, you know, wrapping it around her. The last day, we were, I went for dinner with Mark. And then the fourth day, we moved together. And now we're engaged. And we're getting married. So it's like a really like, romantic story. They're not playing being a couple. They're just, they're just natural. It's wonderful. He's like happy and having fun and talking and laughing and everything. And then Peter is there shooting. You know, I know the sun is like beautiful bridges comes out. There is a beauty from inside these two people that is just extraordinary. And that comes alive in photographs. We both come from like uh, like really I don't know how you say it in English, like basic families. So we both pretty much raised in like a really simple way. Least of everything, I would figure I would be a model. It totally came as a surprise to me. I didn't intend to do this at all. Sometimes I'm supposed to be working in like a cafe or something, and then I'm waiting for him all the time, like I see this bag passing by with his face, you know, and you're like, hey, you know, like that's funny. It's funny because sometimes people ask me, they say, we see them together. Is this is this for real? And I have to laugh at that because you know what? When you spend any time with them, I mean, they're getting married next year. It's a great story. For me, Mark is like Mark. You know, he's like my boyfriend. You know, and he's like he's like my best friend. She's she's warm. She's you know, you fall in love with her not because of her looks. I usually think when you meet the right person, you know it.